last few years, road tripping in camper vans has become a really popular way to travel on a budget. Many people are also taking the trend one step further by living in their vans full time to save money and to enjoy the special freedom and flexibility that a life on wheels can offer. While living and traveling in a van can be a cheap lifestyle, it's certainly not free. We caught up with our friend Julian from GoVan to find out how he's turned his camper van into a mobile home and office so that he can earn money on the road. It was kind of a uh, com combining the uh, really cool aspect of driving, mm -hmm. uh, the best way of driving, you know, and also to generate revenues in the same time. Julian is an entrepreneur and video producer from Montreal, Canada, who lives and works in his van full time. At 30, he sold his first business, an online skateboarding magazine, and invested the money he made in a condo but he still preferred to travel in his 1989 GMC Vandura camper van, looking for adventure and good surf. I really, really, really loved that van. Uh, it was kind of a loungy, you know, it was not a full conversion van. So the interior was like, the, the lighting was amazing, the blue velvet seats and everything. So that was perfect actually for, uh, for a while. The freedom he experienced on his trips in the van and the people he met on the road inspired him to start his second business, the GoVan website, where he shares road tripping stories from fellow travelers and videos about his travels. Everyone I was meeting was so interesting and wanted to share everyone's stories, you know, the road trip stories and traveling stories. To finance the GoVan project, Julian needed a business model. So he started creating video content for brands and tourism bureaus while he traveled. The van is also my office. We film uh, uh, pretty much all summer and um, I don't film myself, I, uh, I produce and, and direct. So the way I work is to invite uh, videographers uh, with me to basically live the van life for usually a week. And um, we just travel for a full week together and it's, uh, it's pretty much uh, adventure style. So, you know, basically one guy is sharing the bed here and uh, some of the guys in a tent. We keep the gear inside here. Uh, that's why we need a van that allows us to charge batteries and is, that is safe and uh, that doesn't break down. When he's working on the website, applying for contracts and planning his upcoming video projects, his mobile office is very simple. He uses a cell phone to create a Wi-Fi hotspot for his laptop and he has a bag full of hard drives for his video footage. To power his laptop and cell phone, he uses the van's house batteries that are charged by the van's alternator or by the solar panels on the roof. This is super useful when you need to uh, recharge batteries and all the gear we have when we uh, film on the road. Mm -hmm. So that's really, really something, uh, a big improvement for my old van, for sure. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Cool. With the inverter and with the, all the power it can generate from the van, uh, this makes uh, this makes the van a super cool office, a su super functional office. Every crew that comes with me, I'm trying to 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 make them feel like they're at home, also in the van. So it creates a really fun moment for a week, uh, you know, even if it's kind of hard sometimes. One of his first video contracts was for a Quebec-based camper van conversion company in 2015. This led to a long-term partnership with them that allows him to use one of their super functional camper vans year-round. Really, I have everything I need. I have a hydraulic rooftop, which is pretty cool. So I just press a button and the roof comes up. <laughs> so that's awesome. <laughs> so there's windows all over. So that's, uh, that's great so when, you, when you work by the river, you know, or by the ocean. Uh, two fridges, which are really great. So you can put a lot of food and not have to stop every day by the, by the grocery store. Now that he has all the comforts of home on the road with him, like running water, a shower, and a kitchen, he's been able to rent out his condo and transition to living and working in the van full time. It's hard to keep up with friends and family. Mm -hmm. um, but besides that, um, it gets just easier and easier. So that's why I don't see a lot of challenges. But uh, obviously there's a few things and here and there that like showers and, but after a little while it just becomes details, you know? I can work whenever I want and uh, if the waves are good, I go surf and I come back and then I can work and, you know, 
it was it's Saturday today. I've been working pretty much all day, but yesterday I've been on, on you know swimming in the ocean. So well, I think that's why people love uh, the band life so much. Yeah. Now that most of these uh, the, the assignments that I we that we had for the summer are pretty much done, I was thinking that I had to go back home, and I just decided this morning that. I don't need to go back home. <laughs> home is here, so so I'll just uh, move and uh, start and, and continue to work from the road. So basically, that's the the, the freedom and the that that I love about working from the road. That's uh, a flexible way of uh, traveling.